We got real super Playboy sauce back on the channel for a dedication song to his late brother. Where should I start? Should I start like four dust apart? House. Always had my back. I wish I had your yours. All oh, this regret. My face feels sore. You was always welcome. Sorry if I ignore. Sorry. You would hit me up. I'm sure you was bored. You were always chill with me. You just slept up on the floor. I fucking no matter what it was. You always had my back. My back. You hit me up to chill. I'll be at work. You would hit me up to check on me, that's why I make it worse first. Hope this love I got, man, it's not a fucking curse. Curse had a lot mm. of long days. Glad I walked up in the church. Mama going through it. Everybody missing love you's house. We was just tight. Promise you this shit ain't right at all. I'ma go hard. I won't stop without a fight. Fight. Feeling all this darkness. It's time to find a light. Light. You was gone too soon. My heart go to the moon. There's not a day I promise I won't think of you, you. Every day I think of you, man, I love you. I love you. Hey, you my big bro, I promise love you. Love, I love you forever. I love you, I love you. You've been through this, you understand. I ain't no about to say that. RP all to the ones gone too soon, man. Like, no cap. I feel like right there to be his favorite way. So he's like transitioning so many photos. Go you know, at, um, was that Paul Walker song? You know what I'm saying? With driving, split off into the highway, stuff like that. With Wiz. This is one of them songs you remember this song, you know what I'm saying? Like you just driving on that straight highway through the desert, you know, just ready for something new. Trying to clear your mind, you know what I'm saying? On to a whole new state, a whole new country, man, just because you know what I'm saying? You want to just leave everything behind and start fresh. Once again, that was real super Playboy sauce, man, with a song dedicated to his late brother, man, named Eddie. We're supposed to say, uh, it was an RIP to Eddie, man. You know what I'm saying? That's the main thing. You know, so I always show love, I always show respect to those who's been lost, man, especially if they gone too soon, man. So Playboy, I feel you. You know I'm saying? I got a bigger brother as well, too, man. I don't, I couldn't imagine. You know what I'm saying? I couldn't imagine, man. But it's also, man, like we've all experienced loss. We've all experienced, you know what I'm saying? Heartache, heartbreak, devastation. You know what I'm saying? I can say the same thing. But one of my best friends that I learned, I loved, that I grew close to super soon, man, Damo. So, you know what I'm saying? I, I understand, man. I understand the heartbreak. I understand the feeling. And when you're a musician, when you're an artist, what you want to do is just put, you know what I'm saying? Music is your therapy. You know what I'm saying? Put your pain on beat, on lyrics. If you got acapella, if you just want to get it out, man, you just get the stuff out of you because it's better to be out than ball it in. You know what I'm saying? Let the music be your release. Let the music be your therapy. You know what I'm saying? Go in that booth. Um, you know, some of the best music comes from heartbreak songs, you know what I'm saying, or from pain and or torment or just like despair, things like that. Yeah, of course, you know what I'm saying, Rod Wade, number one artist in the country, I would say right now with the number one album. You know, we know what, what he brings, you know what I'm saying, and the music that he uh, uh puts out into the world, you know what I'm saying, he makes the best songs when it's stuff like that, man. It's sad that it's got to be in certain situations where people feel like that's where the artist can actually thrive in and flourish is when they're going through heartbreak they're going through heartache some tragic um has happened or anything like that and they feel like it but that's that's like you know it's been proven time and time again you know what i'm saying i mean you look at taylor swift they love when taylor swift going through something she's with heartache or heartbreak because she makes the best music right they don't read too much like her newer stuff because she's with travis kelsey and she's happy and they're like uh oh, it's, it's passable but it also could be a human thing where people just want people to be down all the time and stuff like that man but like I said, man, my heart goes out to you, Superman. You know what I'm saying? Keep keep your head up. You know what I mean? Try to think positive. Try to see, you know what I'm saying? Knowing that tomorrow is a new day. You know what I mean? Uh, feel your feels. It's the main thing a lot of people has always told me throughout the, uh, throughout my life, man. Is feel your feels, man. Don't shy away from it or nothing like that. And, you know what I'm saying? Just use your craft. Use your talent. Use your voice, man. To continue to put out music. You know what I'm saying? And uh, as always, man, he's always going to be there with you. You know what I'm saying? He's always going to be around. 
You can make as much music you want to and mean tribute songs, as many like uh, nostalgia songs, throwing backs, throwbacks of let's like talking in y'all your childhood growing up, the good, the bad, the ugly, you know what I'm saying? The whole lifestyle if you want to, man. But put everything, put your pen to that pad, hit that booth, you know what I mean? Hit that booth, let it all out. And that's where like I feel you will you will begin eventually begin to feel some type of like I said, um, completeness you know what i'm saying a whole lot of everything will start culmination of just like okay we're gonna get through this because you gotta taste the one thing one day at a time well a lot of people don't understand that um as humans man, we put a lot on ourselves as well too man we put a whole lot on ourselves just for the heck of it too we ain't got to like we know control stuff that's in your wheelhouse you know what i mean just like one thing at a time you can only do one thing at a time so basically focus on one prioritize what you need to do to get down, to get dirty, to get to that next level, to get over stuff, to get to your dream, your destination, whatever, man. But a lot of us just like try to do 17 things at once and then we get overwhelmed. And then, you know what I'm saying? We get into like, uh, you know what I'm saying? Despair, You're like, oh, it's too much. And we put too much on our shoulders. We can't deal with it. Blah, blah, one thing at a time. One prioritize, you know what I'm saying? One thing at a time. That's all you got to do. And with that one thing, instead of spreading yourself thin, trying to tackle 15 things at once, and then you can't give it your 100% attention, it's going to take longer than it needs to be. You focus on that one and give it your 100%. It's gone. It's out there. Cross off the board. On to the next. Slowly chop away at that tree. You know what I'm saying? Eventually it comes down, and then you can plant some seeds, and a new one grows. You know what I mean? Once again, man, information for Super B in the description below. At the end of the day, man, that's what we're here for, man. As the SGFL collective, we like to look out for what we consider our own, man. And Super, you one of our own. You know what I mean? So keep your head up, Brody. You know what I mean? And just, man, day by day, one day at a time, all right? From me to you, until next time. And it will be soon. It's your boy, SGFL. I'm out.